Hello, my name is Dr. Rudy Rosen, and I'm your instructor for Texas Aquatic Science and Introduction. I'm a research professor at the Meadows Center for Water and the Environment at Texas State University. I recently wrote the textbook, Texas Aquatic Science, in cooperation with Texas Parks and Wildlife Department and the Hart Research Institute for Gulf of Mexico Studies at Texas A&M University at Corpus Christi. Texas Aquatic Science was modeled after the Missouri Department of Conservation's curriculum, Conserving Missouri's Aquatic Ecosystems, for which some of the text and illustrations were drawn and used or adapted. Funding for our work was provided by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service's Sport Fish Restoration Program and the Ewing Hossel Foundation, San Antonio. This lesson is adapted from the book, Texas Aquatic Science. Production of this lesson and video in part was funded by a grant from the National Science Foundation through the Research Coordination Network for Climate, Energy, Environment, and Engagement in semi-arid regions. Today's lesson is on water and water's influence on life on Earth. To help focus today's lesson, here are a few questions to consider. What is water? And why is water important? What are the special properties of water and why are they important? What is the hydrosphere and what is its important to life on Earth? What are natural resources? What are aquatic resources? How do we use water? How much water is available for human use? What is conservation and why is it important? How can we tell if water is polluted or clean? How does water pollution affect aquatic life? How does water temperature affect the amount of oxygen in it? What is water quality? And how do humans affect water quality? And for the last question, what is the source of your drinking water? Are there any water quality or water quality issues about your water source? What will affect your water source in the future? And who makes decisions that affect your water source?